this one right here. Okay. I found it. So, we've got a sniper rifle, stealth boy, a couple stim packs, and a note. S. Here's the stuff that you wanted. If anyone asks where you got it, say it was a gift from your grandma. Happy, happy hunting, E. Anyway. Now let's go into Megaton. Fellow student on the path of the wasteland, welcome to my humble caravan. Please relax, for we are in a place of safety. The type of safety that can only be ensured by an abundance of weaponry, both wicked and awesome, all of which can be yours for the right price. Please. Enjoy my selection of high-quality problem-solvers. Okay... Let's sell these, that, beer, conductor, empty whiskey bottle. I don't remember if I need those for a quest or anything, but I don't remember. I don't think so. So I'll just sell them. I need the scrap metal for a quest. Uh. Keep one. There we go. Now... I guess I might as well get a hunting rifle. Get both, so that I can get them repaired. And then what kind of ammo do those take? 32. Acceptable. Thanks. Until oh, come on. 
Hey, please. dude. Please help. You, are you serious? I, I can't offer anything in exchange, you know. I, I can just have it. My... Thank you. Karma. Another newcomer. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. I don't know why, but I like you, girl. Something <laughs> tells me you're all right. So welcome to Megaton. Just holla if you need something. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. I'm glad we understand each other. Nope, sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. What about... I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. Not an option, I'm afraid. Hmm. We aren't exactly rolling in. Okay. Great. Go ahead. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. Carry on. I don't remember what skill I need. What amount of skill I need to disarm the thing. Explosives 25 or higher required. Gotcha. Keep that in mind next time I level up. Uh, let's see here. It's a bit dark. Local cult. <laughs> anyway. Moira yet. Water processing plant. Oops. That is the guy I need to talk to about a quest. Um, huh? Yeah, what is it? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Now, I don't expect much from strangers, but if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. I hope you can help. If folks knew how bad it was getting up here, well, I don't know what would happen. All right. Hey, everybody, did the news get around about a guy named Switch of Peace? Old Pete got 
Let's wait until... Sun is up so that I can find these uh, leaks. Probably turn off the radio just in case YouTube decides to get a bit uppity and decide that. Oh, huh. I would have thought she'd be open. Uh, where are those pipes? I know there's one up here that needs repairing. Here's Moriarty Saloon. Ah, uh, come on, you piece of junk. Every day it's the same. My, my. Just when I'd all but given up hope. My dear girl, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. I am Mr. Burke. And you, well... You are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. I made you a rather valuable individual. As you wish. I'm looking to employ an individual with no ties to Megaton. No interest in its future. Megaton is obsolete. The last vestige of a cobbled, desperate past. It needs to... Go away, and you are going to see that it does. It seems I have misjudged you. Hm. Very well. Damn thing. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave station comes in fine. It's Galaxy News. Their signal's been shit late. Hey there. Yeah, I remember that man. I saw him talking to Moriarty. It's hard to forget handsome men like that. Yeah, I'll help you. Then Moriarty kicks my sweet ass out the door. Sorry, kid. If you want to know more, Moriarty is the only one who's gonna help you. Talk to Gob. He hates Moriarty more than I do. Maybe he'll tell you something, but I doubt it. Take care of yourself, hon. Come on. Hey, smooth skin. You need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Wait. You're not gonna hit me? Yell at me? Not even berate me a little bit? Well, now. That's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Oh yeah, I do remember a guy like that. Honestly, I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty, he'll know more. Sorry, smooth skin. I can't take the risk. Moriarty will beat the shit out of me for even talking to you. Alright, is Moriarty back here on his little computer somewhere? For a reason. Yep, there he is. Holland Moriarty, at your service. Welcome to Moriarty's. My saloon, my home, my slice of heaven in this backwoods little burg. If you've got the caps, I've got your pleasure. Please sit down, make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. 
God, it's you. The little baby girl, all grown up. Persistent little flower, ain't you? Then and now, it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here, all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? You seem like a nice kid, so I'm going to be straight with you. Your dad was here, and now he's not. And yes, I know where he went. But what you're asking me for is information, and information is a commodity. Let's say... A hundred cops, and daddy's location is yours. Very reasonable. Guilty? Tell you what, kid. I'm going to help you out. If you don't have the caps to pay for the information... Eager, eh? Good. I like that. It's nice to have a doer in this shithole of a town for a change. This junky bitch named Silver borrowed quite a few caps from me. Claimed she could start funneling Jet and Psycho to me for a good price. Problem is, she scrammed with the loot and set herself up in Springvale so she can inject herself into a stupor. Get the caps she owes me and they're yours. Yours to pay me with, anyway. <laughs> Okay, so I could hack his computer, but I might as well go visit that chick. But I think that's enough for today, so thanks for watching and see you next time.